All right, everyone, we got this. Grab those knitting needles and let's fulfill our destinies. The next person who tells me to chin chill out is going to get a sternly worded letter. I'm talking underlined text with a garish font. Eh, don't sweat it. I've already released several LPs about my affliction. Here, I'll sing you my latest. It's called Chinchilla Thriller, and it goes a little something like this. Oh, don't worry about me. Even like this, I've been able to teach my knitting classes, eat delicious strawberries, and whomever said a chinchilla couldn't shred out a tasty jam never counted on how chinchilla-friendly ukuleles are. So, if I'm understanding you right, you accidentally cursed me with a bottle of water. Ooh, that's a very strange thing to say. But I'm a chinchilla now, so making sense is a luxury I can't afford, apparently. Ooh, ah, I mean, that sound definitely didn't come out of me. Let's move on from this. <laughs> I'm... I'm going to blame my new unbridled chinchilla instincts for that. I'm... I'm sorry I shoved 19 dinner buns in my cheeks. So we gotta hang out and be friends, and that'll somehow break the curse? Hmm. Hmm, sweet. Well, I'm going to pretend we're in a Disney movie anyway, and break out in a song as much as possible, if you don't mind. Oh, man. I got a tail! Oh, I love my little tail. Hey there, you fuzzy little dickens, you. Yeah, sure, let's hang out. Cursed or not, I'm always down for a hangout. Grab a seat. Uh, let's play some games. You look kind of worried. Here, have some tea. I'm going to lay some truth on you. I learned a long time ago that the best way to face destiny is head on. So love the skin you're in, and aim for the sparkliest star in the sky. If this is permanent, at least I'm cute as a button, right? If I seem more chill than chin, it's just because I don't tend to get worked up about things. Except video games, though. In fact, I can get downright grouchy about games. Hey, um, I'm gonna go busk on the main drag today and try to convince people I can play the recorder. Uh, in fact, I cannot do this. So, this should be a fun and very shrill challenge. You can hold the will play for Panini sign if you want. Go ahead, pet the fur. I see you over there all thirsty, wondering if it feels like a dream. Well, it does. Now let those dreams come true. You know, I really haven't done enough singing to my date in a boat for my liking. Wanna go again? You are strangely good at this. Like, you've already made friends with a bunch of other guys under similar circumstances. A and there's not much resistance to your progress. Aha! I was totally just guessing. But that look on your face tells me everything I need to know. Which is cool. Glad to hear I'm working with an expert. Hey! You should know that now that I'm singing you the frog song, you and I are friends. Can't deny the power of the frog song. <laughs> Just kidding. Yeah, there's a smile. Love it. I started writing a song about how all of this has made me feel, but then I started rapping about butts and probably forgot the lyrics. Butts, am I right? <laughs> nice. You don't have to buy me all this swag, but, well, I'm not going to say no, am I? <laughs> that was so dangerous! <laughs> I think I'm in shock! Yay! Hey, I need someone to harmonize with me. Feel like rapping about memes for a few hours in a recording booth today? Swell! My usual partner is a bit busy being a dinosaur who wants to eat me. But, I mean, can you blame him? Don't tell him, though. I don't want to bruise his ego. Oh, dear. I appear to have chewed through my guitar. 
and made a nest inside of it. I'm 99% sure I did all this in my sleep. I would very much like to change back now. Nice! You... Oh. Chinchilla teeth never stop growing. They never give up or let you down. They never desert you. I think that's beautiful. And thanks to them, I think we've all learned a valuable lesson. From the sounds of it, it's taken up a lot of time racing around, rescuing us Anamorphan Rangers. Why don't we take a break and help some grannies cross the street? That always gives me the honey glow. Um, hey, would you mind holding me up Lion King style? I'm going to sing Circle of Life and I just... I can see how awesome this is going to be in my mind. Will you help my dreams come true and be my baboon? Hey, I need some help. I need to keep my smolder sharp even when I've been turned into a fuzzy tooth goblin. So if you don't mind, just sit there and I'll get some practice in. Ready? <clears throat> hey there. <coughs> ah! Why wasn't I scared? Oh, well, my best friend is a bloodthirsty dinosaur. I just don't have room for fear in my life. Okay, hit me with the plan again. You kiss me. And I turn back. Is that right? Actually, that's a super straightforward plan. Not sure why I made you repeat it. Uh -huh. Pucker up, buttercup. Huh. I've got mixed feelings here. I love kissing. But I haven't tried to kiss anyone with these chompers in the mix yet. So... Best of luck to us both. Oh, thank you. Thank you. It's good to be back. Shout out to all my super short homies out there. I have seen the world through your eyes. And you guys are definitely fighting the good fight. By the by, please let me know if you'd like me to keep the language more savory than spicy. Sometimes I'll be jamming and suddenly the song will take a detour into flavor country. I'm talking what the cuss levels here. Let's mix it up. No? Too lame? Okay, how about, um, let's have some trail mix. G a cake mix? Damn it. Look, I know I've mostly changed back, but I can still see that thirsty look. You want to touch the hair, don't you? Well, now's your chance. Don't let this opportunity slip away. I'm gonna warn you up front, just in case you come to any of our shows, that my band is pretty metal. There's a dinosaur and an assassin from feudal Japan. Oh, and I wear a leotard. We mostly play smooth jazz. Hmm. I have the sudden urge to declare that parody is not a violation of copyright. You know, like when people make derivative artistic works based on the works of others for the purpose of criticism or satire. Hmm. Weird. Hey, let's you and I go on an adventure today. My treat. Or we can play video games for nine hours and record ourselves joking around. You know, whatever you're down for. <laughs> uh, nothing says I love you like a dinner bun bitten into the shape of a heart. My grandmother taught me that. Hey, just wanted to let you know that I'm still thinking about that kiss. One, because it rocked me to my core. And two, because you kissed a mouse. You goofy mouse smoocher. <laughs> hey, hey, this is super nice. You're an exceptional person with a generous spirit. Look at you. Hey, I just thought you should know that you're looking like a fresh slice of summer watermelon today. In fact, you're the whole fruit platter. I'm actually super hungry. Do you want to go grab a bite? Feel like hitting the club? I'm jonesing to get my dance on. Having normal body dimensions is even more uplifting than I imagined. Great! Because I also really, really wanted it to be with you. Let's bounce. Boop! Got your nose! 
Actually, it's just my thumb held between my fingers. I enjoy over-explaining jokes and letting the awkward silence speak for itself. Let's listen. Yes, the hat was entirely necessary and the Shakespearean accent. One doesn't just play the mandolin unless they're prepared to bring their A-game. So, this is slightly awkward, but I've got a big fat crush on you. And unlike a normal, well-adjusted member of society, I've decided to tell you directly to your face. Is that cool? Great. I figured I've basically been hanging out with you naked the whole time as a chinchilla, so there's no need to be shy or beat around the bush. Oh, hey! Didn't see you there. Actually, I've been waiting in this spot for 30 minutes. Waiting for you to come by. My intentions are sweet, but I suck at scheduling. You can be as suspicious as you like. I'm not sure how those sparkles got in my hair, but they looked pretty snazzy in the breeze, hey? <laughs> You're such a merry prankster. Just don't tickle my feet or I'll end you. Hey, look at you with that face of yours and those lips and that ghostly complexion. You look good enough to mix into some ice cream. You're welcome. I'm not sure why they call ice cream with marshmallows and chocolate Rocky Road. Because if you were a road, you'd be hella smooth. <laughs> Sorry, I'm being weird today. Now you remind me of a tasty ass guitar solo. Blasting out right at the climax of the song and blowing my goddamn mind. Either that or a cola bottle gummy. I love those things. I can pretty much listen to you talk for hours which I find almost ridiculously attractive. One sec, I'm going to see if I can find a phone book for you to read. I've got a show coming up. I was wondering if you'd like to come. I can get you tickets for the scream and cry section or the father forced to bring his daughter section. Your pick. Hey, hold my hand. Yeah, there you go. No, that's it. That's what I wanted. Thanks. Also, your hands are so soft. <laughs> Sorry, random memory. I was thinking of your face when you transformed me into a rodent. It was very, I'm so dead. <laughs> I'm seeing a lot of comments on my channel asking me to change back into a chinchilla. Classic internet, right? Out of curiosity though, super random question. Do you have any more of that water kicking around? I'm asking for a friend. Not gonna lie, the acoustics in that haunted house were amazing. The walls were the rock stars there, not me. Oh, thanks! You're like a sugar daddy and a dream mama all mixed into a gorgeous, frankly, adorable package. <laughs> I said package. I know you've probably got like 19 boyfriends at this point. But I'd sure like to be your boyfriend. Is that cool? We all good here? Great. In case you were worried about me being the jealous type, I should let you know that I'm sort of a more the merrier type of guy. Hey, I took this picture for my resume, but thought Maybe it was a little NSFW, and I didn't want it to go to waste. So, whenever you're feeling blue, just whip this bad boy out and remember how much I care about you. Also, how good my chest looks, right? Love you, boo. Oh, glad you're here. I've got all this loving and nowhere to put it all. Give me a squeeze. Oh, thanks. You're like a sugar daddy and a dream mama all mixed into a gorgeous, frankly, adorable package. <laughs> I said package. Hey, how about we dance the night away until we're literally crushed under the sheer romance of the atmosphere? Take my hand. Let's do this. Hey, you still rock my world every day, every time. Thanks for keeping me in the mix. Oh! <laughs> 
Never gets old. Oh, yikes. I was playing video games today, and I'm super grouchy now. No, no. No reason to worry. It's a brand thing. But I sure could use a snuggle and something decadent and tasty. I feel super enthused about this pair of underwear. I feel like they get me. And the pockets are the cherry on top. Uh, you know, everyone's always dressing up as a werewolf. Tonight, I'm dressing up as a Y-wolf. That means I'm super deep, but still heckin' cute. Boop my nose! Ask anything of me, and my answer will be, quite simply, as you wish. Hey, hey! Yeah, those would make some great song lyrics! Oh, hey! Didn't see you there. Mm, no, 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 let me let me try that again, but sexier. Oh, hey, didn't see you there. Oh, this really brings me back. Remember when I used to fit in your pocket? Uh, this might sound crazy, but what if we tried that again? Would that be adorable or super weird? There's no feeling better than the roar of the crowd. Except maybe the touch of a loved one. But it's a close call. I mean, damn. They say the best way to say I love you in a song is without using those exact words. So tell me if this phrase works for you. <clears throat> boom it, boom it, boom, boom. You know, yay, nay. Hmm. I made too much sandwich which I'm just as shocked as you are, having found out this was possible. Here, have sandwich. It's made with love. There's also a pickle in there. Ah, oh, man, you, you should have heard me in the shower this morning. I was killing it on this one song. Whew, I really wish you were there. What I'm saying is that we should shower together. Giggity. Oh, I got the sweetest gift basket from my knitting class. Apparently those grandmas liked my fuzzy ears. But they were happy that I was happy to be back to normal. Oh, okay. This is making me tear up. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I'm such a sap. Quick question. How would you feel if a flash mob suddenly appeared and started performing an enormous musical number complete with live musical accompaniment? Also, how would you feel if it was about to happen in three, two? I was half expecting you to disappear at midnight when the curse was broken. Happy to see that this isn't the case. I'd like to kiss you now, unless that'll turn you into a pumpkin or something. I feel now is a great time to be cautious about magics. Lame pickup line time! Uh, hey! Do you believe in love at first sight? Or should I pass by again? Or, oh, wait, are you visually impaired? I just realized that this pickup line makes a whole bunch of potentially disastrous assumptions. I've really got to stop saying, drop me a beat whenever I hear someone accidentally make a rhyme during conversation. It's an impulse that I must tame. A fan sent me a plushie they made. It looks like me when I was still a chinchilla. Aww. Well, I mean, the one eye is probably not supposed to be hanging like that. And the expression is genuinely terrifying, but very sweet. I only spent an hour on my hair this morning. I had places to be, people to be with. So if it's looking more bed than head, you now know the sinister truth. Lame pickup line time. I feel pretty blessed. Here I am back to normal, and my normal includes wearing a thong and a cape on stage and singing rock and roll songs about obscure memes. Life is pretty sweet. You mischievous scamp. If you think you're going to escape reprisals, think again. <laughs> no, 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 no tickles. My laugh is on the dork spectrum, and everyone is better off not having to deal with it. You mischievous scamp. <laughs> you! You are in my bubble, and I love it. But it's also a flagrant violation of all the tickle treaties. Stand aside! You can be anything you dream, because you're everything to me. 
Just don't ever be a stranger. Want to go for a drive? Or a bike ride? Or like a unicycle ride? I've got this strange urge to be with you while I'm moving, I guess? You ever look up at the sky, watch the clouds roll by, and think, yeah, I'm enjoying the ride? I get that a lot nowadays. Oh, hey, I wrote you a song. Actually, I wrote you like nine songs, but unless you've got an hour to kill, I'll just pick my favorite and sing it. <laughs>